Okay, for this experiment, I have two cups of water. One cup of hot water and one cup of cold water. I'm going to place a piece of dry ice in each. Now, make sure you are working in a well-ventilated area. You have windows open. Make sure you're wearing gloves if you're handling dry ice. Do not eat the dry ice. Okay. So I'm going to take a big chunk of dry ice and I'm going to drop it in the cold water. Take a look at what's happening. CO2 gas! Gas, gas, gas. Now I'm going to take a big chunk. I'm wearing gloves. Take a big chunk and I'm going to drop it in the warm water. Oh. Whoa! Woo! Woo! That warm water! Look at that! Oh my god! Wow! <laughs> I'm just kidding. Whoa! So, what can we say about warm versus cold water? Obviously, more CO2 gas is being produced with the warm water. It's making quite a mess. I'm pretty good at that. You want to make sure not to inhale the gas. So you notice I'm not putting my face right over it. Because inhaling too much CO2 gas can be bad. Wow!